everybody and welcome back to another Monday plan with me. This week I'm planning from October the 29th to November the 4th. The kit I will be using is this Hocus Pocus kit from the Plump Planner on Etsy. I'm also using some orange headers from the shop. And I might pull in some of the black ones from this Kels Beth sheet, as well as the gold ones on the Once More with Love foiled sheets. And I will be using the Deco as well. Um, I will use the gold foil header overlays from Diamond Prince Designs on the normal glitters and washi I'm going to use will probably be these three and I also have my glitter date covers from Once More With Love and the rest of my countdown from Once Yes, from Once More With Love. Um, I'm going to speed through placing the kit and then I will get into the day by day. So for the placing of the kit for this week, we just use the ombre washi and the Halloween gold fold washi at the bottom and then for the top I was going to use the orange ombre but I have no white out left and you could see through it so I just used some more Halloween washi along with my glitter date covers from Your World of Colour did mess up early uh, before when I was filming and said they were from Once More With Love for some reason probably still because I'm full of cold and can't think straight <coughs> excuse me um i then use the foiled headers from the once more with love sheets and the orange glitter headers from the plump planner and i just place the boxes where i feel like i want to put them After placing the first lot of foiled ones, I did realise that I needed to place the full boxes down first before that header. So then they kind of went over the top of the box a little bit. But I think these look um, really good. So I just place all these down. And then um, I move on to my sidebar, which is just the usual. I also place down the rest of my Halloween countdowns from Once More With Love. So I place some of the black headers from the Calzabeth sheet uh, this do this is from one of the happy planner sheets that you get in the books and i just use some washi at the bottom to put my habit tracker on all the deco is from a happy planner sticker book so moving on to day by day to start monday I do my normal coffee Monday, so I use a half box from the kit and for each day I use the half box that has the background from the same deco box that's down for that day. Um, on top of this I use uh, one of the Halloween coffee mugs from 
Coffee Monsters Co. I then want to share my weekly spread on Instagram, so I use one of the Autumn Planner Girl stickers from Fox and Cactus, and I also want to film, so I use a YouTube play button from the Coffee Monsters Co. I use a, another one of the, well I was going to use, oh I do use black, further on I use a different colour, but I use the black headers and a diamond sticker from Diamond Prince Designs, which you get on my freebie if you use my code. This is to mark uh, some blog work, I then use a YouTube pop it from Laura Jane Style to mark that this plan with me will be going up and then one of the autumn coffee emotes from Coffee Monsters Co to mark binge watching plan with me videos on YouTube. For Tuesday we're off down to my mum's so I just use one of these deco stickers from Lucinda Charlotte. I then use a Emoti eating pumpkin pie to mark that we're going to have um, lunch from Jasper's and then this 15 frill unicorn to mark that we have the dentist. Uh, lastly I use a half box from the kit along with a Facebook emoti to mark that I want to do some promoting for diamond prints designs. Moving on to Wednesday after busy day Tuesday, um, I want to have a lion, so I use an orange header from the pump planner sheet and a sleep in sticker from the fox and cactus. I don't know why I used a black on Monday and then used orange for the rest but then I use a gold foiled heart which is also from my freebie from diamond prints designs to mark that I want to edit and then I use a laptop emoji to mark that I want to do some more blog work. I then use a half box and a Instagram doodle from Coffee Monsters Co to mark that I want to do some promoting for your world of colour. All my um, PR codes will be down below if you want to do any ordering from any of these shops and um, can't quite see this properly but I use a shopping foiled script from planning by Miss Eve to mark that I need to do my online shopping. I then use some of the Halloween deco from the foiled sheet by Once More With Love to mark that we will be having our Halloween tea. Moving on to Thursday, I use a, another foil, uh, not foiled, glitter header and place a payday foiled script from my Diamond Prince Designs freebie to mark that it is payday. I also want to um, order some more stickers, so I use a Etsy Sprouty from the Sprouted Paper Co. And I need to film next week's plan with me, so I use a YouTube button from the 
Buffy Monsters Co. to mark this. I have a few bills due, so I use a half box and I place a bill due script across the top of it and then I'll just make a small list of the bills that I have due and I then use a bin sticker from your watercolour to mark which bins need to go out. For Friday I it is Focus Friday because I use the I'm trying to do the organised mom method of cleaning so I use a half box and a Le Petite Paula witch character And then I need to do the voiceover for next week's plan with me, so I use a musical emoji to cover up the header line if I was doing this for the HP size. And I cover that up with the glitter header and use another Laura Jane style um, pop it to mark if a video will be going up. I then use um, a pizza sticker from Fluffy Maru Designs to mark pizza night and then I use another foiled shopping sticker so I can mark down at what time my shopping will be delivered. For the weekend uh, the girls want to do some Pokemon so I use a Pokemon Munchkin from Once More With Love and then a Facebook emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that I want to do some promoting for Diamond Prince Designs. I also need to edit next week's plan with me, so I use a half box but I forgot to uh, get a edit sticker so I'll put that in after and then I use the bear onesie emoji to mark, to mark that we will just be having a relaxing evening. On to Sunday I use another one of the Instagram doodles from Coffee Monsters Co to mark that I want to do some promoting for Diamond Prince Designs. I also use another emoji eating pumpkin pie to mark we're going out to Toby's for lunch and then a alarm clock left over from a Harriet Wright Designs kit to mark early night because the girls will be back at school on the Monday so I put down my school checklist. Um, that is everything for this week. I'm just going to go through and place the rest of the foiled deco from the Once More with Love Sheet. I also thought the broom would be good next to my Focus Friday place. I um, These stickers are lovely. I'm hoping when the shop reopens they're still available because these Halloween Ford stickers I thought were really cute. So hopefully I can order a couple sheets of those and put them up for next year. Um, but I'm going to leave it here and fill all this in and then I will get back to you with my finished spread. This is my spread all finished. As you can see I put my foil all down. I love how this turned out with the added foil bits. Um, I do need to put some date dots on, but I for here I used a piece of uh, the deco from the kit. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are new to this channel, uh, please subscribe. I'd love to have you over here. Um, this is my last Halloween spread, so next ones are going to be autumn ones um uh, but uh, thanks for watching and i will see you in my next video 
uh, which I'm not sure I'll have another one up this week um, as the girls are off school and I don't have anything pre-recorded uh, if not I will see you in the next plan with me which will be for the 5th of November bye